Fan films does not mean films about fans. Duh. <laughs> oh, hi. The Crazy Kaiju here, and I'm here to talk about fan films and how we review them. Mm-hmm. Here, we broke it down into three categories. Here we go. Number one, story, which to us is considered the core of the film. Is the story original? Is it well-balanced? Now, balanced to us means if there's a beginning, a middle, and end. For example, beginning introduces most of the characters involved and presents what the problem might be. Middle, try to solve the problem that has presented itself. End, which resolves or concludes the result of the problem. Another thing is dialogue, the lines given to the characters. Too much info, not enough info, unnecessary info, scripted or unscripted lines, and how naturally the lines were said. Number two, camera. Now to us, this is the eye candy, phase one. You know, the visual to the story you are telling. Remember, we see everything that rectangular box shows us. Everything. So, make it sweet. Different angles and lighting is a plus. Our pet peeve here is focus, focus, focus. If your device does not have manual focus, then learn how to operate your camera before filming. Number three, edit. Wisely use practical, green screen, stop motion, and software effects from explosions to backgrounds is our eye candy phase two. If it doesn't look good, either tweak it or don't use it. And just remember this, it's not the tools that you have, it's how you use them. Mm-hmm. Other things we look at is music score, sound effects, and color balance. Our pet peeve in this category is knowing when to slice or cut your scenes by using different angles for the same shot. This really helps viewer retention. Now, I think the majority of you who watch fan films can generally relate to what I just explained. But to the ones making fan films, please use this as a simple guide to maybe make your films better. A little advice to you filmmakers. When you finish a fan film, don't post it right away. Walk away from your computer. Get outside of the house, do some physical stuff for an hour. Then come back and watch your film from beginning to end without pausing. If you think to yourself, eh, it's good enough, then you just told yourself that it could be better. Also, before posting, show it privately to other people and not as a group, better as a one-on-one. -on -one to get better feedback. Well, hope this was helpful for you filmmakers and have a good day.